Why do I feel like it's Friday when technically it is Thursday, January 26th? I've been feeling like it's Friday all day long. Let me know in the comments if that's just me or maybe everybody else is feeling that way. I don't know. It could be some weird... <sighs> I don't know. Anyway, it just feels weird. It feels like a Friday to me even though we're really Thursday. But technically by the time you see this video, it will be Friday. So, okay, my head is starting to hurt. Let me stop now. On the plus side, we have these beautiful clear blue skies for our Thursday afternoon. Look how the sun is reflecting off those pine trees. It makes them look almost orange. That's actually very pretty. I just saw Kai Kai go past my window, so I think she's still looking. Either that or she's just roaming. Mom and I came to the conclusion that the cats are still roaming around. So if they're okay outside, then Lucky has to be okay because that cat was tough. That little cat was tough. He was not a real inside cat by any stretch of the imagination. He technically was a stray. He technically was outside when he first showed up. So I think he will be okay. Mom thinks he's going to be okay. She's still upset about it. She's still mad that she couldn't catch him in time. I have checked all the shelters that I could get to within at least a good 20 miles. So nobody has a cat by his markings or anything like that. So you know what? I think we're just going to have to just accept that he's gone. Essentially, except that he took off, he's gone, he's on his own. That's what he wanted to do to begin with. Maybe he was just passing through, I don't know, but you never know with a cat. We do miss him, though. We do miss him a lot. And I'm not going to say that I don't miss him because that little cat grew on me. I knew he grew on a lot of you as well. So, i got to stop saying the word so, so much, don't you think? It's becoming a habit. If we're going to accept that Lucky has possibly found himself another home, then the question becomes, do I leave Lucky's name in the channel name or not? I don't know. I want to. I don't want to. I don't know if I will. I should leave it alone just the way it is so that it will be like putting Lucky in memorial in a sense. He's not dead though. Not by at least not that I know of. But it will memorialize his time with us. That's one good thing it'll do. I want to leave it up to you guys. What do you think we should do? Leave it or change it? I have a few ideas. I'll drop the ideas in the description box below and in the first pinned comment. Should I actually remember to use the pinned comments for once? That would be nice. I need to write that down. It's only two ideas. It's just really just variations of the... Of what we already have. I'm honestly thinking of just leaving it well enough alone. And I know some are going to say. It's up to you. Go ahead and do what you want. I really do think we should have that decision for everybody to make. I might actually post that as a poll. If I decide to do that. Look for a community tab coming out later on Friday night. Yeah. Check out the community tab. They should have a poll come out. If I decide to do a poll. And that way you can decide. It's just between two names. That's it. Again, like I said, I don't know. Because the second I do that, and the cat's going to show back up, right? So, you know what? I don't know. Thinking about that has actually been giving me a headache all day. At least it was sunny. It was chilly, though, but it was sunny today. And Duke being Duke, he doesn't want to be outside. He does not like being in the cold, so he's been inside with Grandma. He's actually been staying pretty doggone close to Grandma, because I think he knows she's upset. I know he's a little bit upset, too. I know it hurts her. She says that he took a little piece of her heart with her, just like Mary when Mary passed away. And I understand that, believe me. Because he took a piece of my heart, too, with him. Don't know why he left like that. I really don't know why he ran off like that. If I could understand why he did that or know where he is, at least know that he's okay, I think that would make both me and my mom feel a lot better. To tell you the truth. For those who like our Cajun culture videos that we do, we're going to be doing one that I think you're going to find interesting. Both me and my mom technically were exposed to it. I will explain everything next week. I don't want to give out too much because you never know. I'm going to keep it a secret until next Friday. You'll see what I'm talking about when I get the video 
scheduled and posted and up. But it's got to do with a centuries-old Cajun tradition that is a dying tradition. You don't really see a lot of that anymore in Louisiana. That's part of our culture that's dying off. I'm hoping that you're going to like that video. But I think it's interesting. It's a part of our culture. And a lot of people have probably heard about it and probably have not. I figured I'd share it with you guys. The chickens are still around, I'll tell you that much. Felix and Gus keep wanting to fight each other. And Felix is that big giant red and black rooster. And Gus is the one that looks exactly like Rooster Boy. There's that fun. I'm always having to go out and try to separate two roosters. Probably not the smartest of ideas. They don't belong to me anyway. Why am I trying to separate them? <laughs> I'm gonna end up getting hurt. I shouldn't be doing that. Don't forget to join us for next Friday's video. I think you're going to enjoy it. And we will have our shorts over the weekend on Saturday and Sunday. Cajun word or phrase of the day. And if you like that, the Cajun word or phrase of the day that I do over the weekends. Let me know in the comments below as well. And I might actually keep that past Mardi Gras. Because I'm only doing that for Mardi Gras right now. We'll see how things go. Remember to bring some joy, laughs, and smiles to somebody's day. And we will see you in our next one. Have a wonderful weekend, everyone. Later.